Tsunami Basics, what to do if there is a tsunami, brought to you by the National Weather Service located in Monterey, California. A distantly generated tsunami has occurred. What do you do? Although time is of the essence, don't panic. Depending on the location of the tsunami generating earthquake, you could have up to 10 hours to prepare. Listen for official messages from the National Weather Service. Is this message a watch, warning, or an advisory? Respond to these official messages and to what your local emergency management officials are saying to do, being sure to heed their recommendations. Be prepared for a natural disaster by having a plan. Be sure to keep an earthquake tsunami kit prepared. At the minimum, this kit should contain medications, a radio, batteries, cash, food, water, and pet supplies. Know the tsunami safe zones and evacuation routes. Be sure to have a meeting place in mind in case you and your group become separated. Keep an eye out for tsunami hazard signs located in tsunami-ready communities. In the event of a tsunami, follow these signs to safety. The National Weather Service issues four types of tsunami messages. The initial message may be a tsunami watch, which means that an earthquake has occurred that may result in a tsunami. Stay tuned for more information. If a tsunami is generated and widespread inundation of the land is imminent or occurring, a tsunami warning will be issued. Please evacuate to higher ground. A tsunami advisory is issued when a tsunami has been generated but little to no inundation of the land is expected. However, strong currents are imminent or occurring. Please move away from the shore, harbors, and marinas. Finally, the tsunami information statement is a heads up to let you know that a distant event has occurred and we are looking into it. No action is required at this point. An earthquake has happened near your location and has generated a tsunami. What do you do? In this case, Mother Nature will provide you with a tsunami warning. The first sign will be vigorous shaking of the earthquake. Protect yourself by crawling under a sturdy table or desk. Stay under the shelter holding on until the shaking has ceased. Remain under cover for at least 20 seconds after the shaking has ceased. If by the water, look for a rapid withdrawal of water from the beach and listen to the ocean. You may hear the ocean rumbling louder than usual. Respond. Walk or run quickly to higher ground. Remember, in most cases, you only need to move 20 feet above sea level to find safety from the tsunami. In summary, if a distantly generated tsunami occurs, don't panic. Remain calm. Although time is of the essence, you have some time to prepare. Listen for official messages from the National Weather Service. Listen to what your local emergency management officials are saying and heed their recommendations. Finally, respond by listening to your local emergency officials and heed their recommendations even if it means evacuation. Remember, if a local tsunami is generated, listen to Mother Nature. The earthquake will be your first warning. Respond accordingly. Walk quickly or run to higher ground and remember that in most cases you only need to reach an elevation of 20 feet above sea level to find safety. Here are some links to additional information about tsunamis. Special thanks to the California Emergency Management Agency and the California Geological Survey. For local weather and tsunami information, please visit us via the web, Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. As always, you can give us a call at 831-656-1725.